You may have noticed the extra markings on 23rd Street between Ottawell Drive and Spadina Crescent with the Green Pass. They are protected bike lanes, which means they are physically separated from vehicles on the road by the parking lane. The city has a video on YouTube which explains everything about how they work, and here are a few highlights. Only people traveling on bikes are allowed to use the lanes. No scooters or skateboards. Protected bike lanes make cycling safer and are easy to use. Signs are in place to let everyone know what to do when traveling on or alongside the protected bike lane. One of the most basic signs is this one. It means there is a dedicated bike lane on the roadway. People driving cars are not permitted to travel or stop in this lane unless they are making a right turn onto a cross street or into a driveway. An important new rule for people driving in cars is that they cannot make a right turn at a red light where there is a protected bike lane. And this sign reminds people driving cars that people on bikes have the right of way through the intersection. If you're in a car and you want to turn right, you need to yield to people on bikes. You can click on the link to see the whole video on saskatoon.ca in the Moving Around section. The 4th Avenue Protected Bike Lane will open next year and will run between 19th Street East and 24th Street and will connect to the Broadway Bridge. Carol Thompson, saskatoonhomepage.ca.